नमो नम प्रिय मित्रांनी अस्मिन सप्ताहे वयम धातूना दशगणा विषये इतोपि किंचित सम्यक परिचयं प्राप्तवंत अद वयम तत्र धातूना दशलकारा विषये इतोपि किंचित ज्ञास्याम एंड तत्रापि कर्मवाच्य किंचित परिचयं प्राप्स्याम तरी नमस्ते डियर फ्रेंड्स एंड अ वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू दिस सेशन वन्स मो in this week we've been focusing on looking at the different verbs the groups of the different verbs in order to try and understand their characteristics that allows them to become part of that particular classification in today's class we're going to be looking at another aspect of the verbs which is the ten tenses and moods or the dasha lakaraha so in today's class which is part of module 5 looking at the revision of dhatu rupani and an introduction to karma vachyam we are looking at lecture 15 which is an understanding of the 10 lakaras as i mentioned in the parasmai padi and in the atmane padi so the concepts that are covered in this particular session are a quick overview of the revision of the building blocks of a sentence some general information on the dhatus an introduction to all the 10 lakaras representing the tenses and moods and we'll do some practice conjugating them in the parasmai padi and in the atmane padi and then we'll follow up with a conversation for building vocabulary and application of the points learned uh, and then we'll close with some verses defining tirthanusaranam which is the next quality in the verse on dharma and then there's a quote by swami paramahansa yogananda on the importance of tirthanusaranam so this is an overview of the sanskrit sentence and uh, we've been focusing on the uh, so bantas we've done that already and last time we were looking at the 10 10 ganas in today's section as we mentioned we're going to be looking at the 10 lakaras and how they are uh, a part of the uh, atmane padi conjugation or the parasmai padi but what we are going to be looking at is one verb uh, the verb pach in particular that is an ubhaya padi verb it uh, it can be under, done or it can be conjugated in the atmane padi as well as in the parasmai padi and what determines that so when we are doing the cooking pach meaning cooking when you're cooking for somebody else then it is in the parasmai padi when you're cooking the fruit of the cooking is enjoyed by the doer himself or the cook himself or herself then it is in the atmane padi so that's why this is a verb which is an ubhaya padi verb the same for you with an example of balaka gachati some facts about sanskrit dhatu so there are more than 2000 roots as we've seen earlier enumerated by the ancient grammarians and less than half are used around 800 of them and tadapi yataha vayam idanim sambhashanam na kurma sanskrite adhikam na cha tatra tatha lekha bhavati ataha tatra bhashayah prayogah athava dhatu nam prayogah nyunah jatah vartate kintu asham karomi yat सर्वे अभी मिलवा यदा वह संस्कृत से संभाषण प्रचार त्र लेखन च क्या तदानी पुनरपी तेजा धातूना पुनरुज्जीवन भविष्य अस्तु तरी वॉट इज द वॉट आर द डिफरेंट कॉम्पोनेंट्स ऑफ द संस्कृत वर्ब प्रथम भाग अस्त द रूट और द धातु प्लस द सफिक्स और द विकरण प्रत्यय दैट वी आर नाउ वेरी फेमिलियर विथ एंड देन द एंडिंग ऑफ द थिंग अंत विच विल टेल स्पेसिफिकली Uh, who is doing it which purusha is doing it how many are doing it which vachana is it and finally what is the uh, tense or the mood or the lakaraha itself astu so there are 10 ganas as we've seen uh, which are the classification of the verbs into the 10 groups the verbs can have several meanings they are nanarthakaha dhatavaha and uh, sometimes depending on which group they are they carry different meanings altogether and then the verbs can also be conjugated as we've seen in the parasmai padi where the fruit is directed towards another it can be an atmane padi where it is towards oneself and some verbs have both forms they are ubhaya padi and they do not really uh, change meaning also and sometimes they do but sometimes they need not 
And then there are the 10 lakaras or the tenses and moods in which the verbs are conjugated. So, dasha gananam parichaya tatra bhuadyadadi juhotyadi is divadiswadi revacha tuda discharuddha discha tanakriya dischurada yaha. Asu, etatyadi jananti tari dasha gananam. Parichayam samyak vyasyanti api because if you just know how each of those verbs is conjugated in the beginning, then you'll have an idea of the kind of vikarana pratyayaha that is uh, introduced in that particular group. Another format for understanding the dhatu ganaha with their vikarana pratyayaha. So let's look at the 10 lakaras, tatra pratham, which is the focus in fact of our study today. Tatra prathama lakara asti lat. Lakara uta vartamana kala, dvitiya asti uh, or the present tense, dvitiya asti the lit, parokshe lit, which means that it is a past tense, but that which is beyond the period that we can witness. It's not pratyaksha, it's paroksha. And then you have the lut, which is the anadhyatana bhavishya. So the lut is a future which is not of uh, the present time, but later on, not today's future. Lit uh, adhyatana bhavishya dasti, lit is within the scope of today, the future that will happen within the scope of today. Lot is the ajnya or the imperative mood. Lang is the anadhyatana bhuta. So lang is the uh, past tense which has not happened today. Vidhi ling is uh, the form that is used for uh, ordaining something which has to be done according to a particular norm. And then you have got the ashir ling which is the uh, ling that is associated with the blessings of somebody. So it must happen this way in that context. And then you've got the lung, the adhyatana bhuta. So it is a past tense within the scope of today. And then you've got the ring or the bhavishyat, but this is a bhavishyat and a bhuta combined. It's the ring also known as the kriyati patil ring, which indicates um, that uh, something could have happened if something else was in a particular case. So, uh, for example, uh, if there was time, then I would have uh, completed my book, for example. Okay, so this kind of a, a future in the past or the future in the past is the kind of a ring that is being referred to in this context. Now, I'd just like to mention to you that uh, it's a very beautiful way of organizing. Tari lakarana matra vyavastha bahu uttama asti karanam. It goes with the swaras and the lat. The takara first and then the ng that comes in. So, lat, lit, so a, e, u, ha. Huh? So, you've got lat, lit, lut, lit, lot. And I'd just like to mention that there is another lakara, anya eka lakara asti, uh, ved, uh, vede late iti. Tari late lakara asya, uh, vede eva upayogaha bhavati, anantaram tasya, uh, vayam na pashyamaha prayogam. Tari late kintu atah atra na yojita masti atra in fact ling dvayam asti. So you've got the lang ling, so vidhi ling and ashir ling. Uh, ling dvayam antar bhuta masti. Punaha lung asti and ring for the bhavishyat. So just in terms of memory, uh, there is an easy kind of a logic underlying the lakaras. Astu agre pashyama. Adhyavayam pach dhatoho. Uh, uh, ubhaya padyam rupani dasha lakareshu drakshyamaha uh, tatrapi pach dhatuhu bhuadi ganasya uta prathama ganasya dhatuhu asti uh, and etadapi uh, satyam yad pratyeka ganasya, ganasya swa swa swabhavaha vartate yada dasha lakareshu rupani bhavanti kintu vayam sarvan drashtum na shakshyamaha uh, sarvan dhatum tatra drashtum kleshaya bhavati asmin nirdishte kale uh, kintu vayam asham kurma yad atra parichayam prapya anyesham uh, dhatunam api dasha lakareshu jnyatum utsaha yushmasu uh, bhavishyati iti. Tari pach dhatoho mulam kimasti. Now you would never imagine huh, that the root of the verb pach is something as complex as dupachangsh pake, as you can see, to cook. Uh, because it's the first gana atah tatra shap prat, uh, vikarana pratyaha asti. But just I was talking to Piyush and saying that you know the imagine the genius of Panini that he felt the need to add these extra sounds like do and pa and pacha and then the sh at the end. 
So we see that there are specific sutras that then lead it uh, up to the form of pach that we are more familiar with in the context of cooking. And tat sarvam bhavati and you come down here and you see that there is uh, the present groups forms that are there to make it the parasmai padi pachati and then there is actually just one extra sutra which is titta atmane padanam tere yena esha eshaha dhatuhu pachate iti atmana atmane padi rupe api milati tari vayam uh, prathama lakaraha tatra lak lakare vartamane uh, parama, parasmai padyam rupani prathamam drishtva anantaram uh, vartamana kale atmane padyam api drakshyamaha astu arambhetari militva vadama karanam bhavanta etani rupani samya keva jananti tari pachati pachataha pachanti pachasi pachataha pachatha pachami pachavaha pachamaha uttamam uh, atmane padyam kim bhavati pachate pachete pachante pachase pachete pachadhue pache pachavahe pachamahe astu uh, tatra cha eka samyam vartate tari aham etad praka, anya prakaram api prastutam aka, uh, tasya prastavanam akaravam tatra kim cha pasyamaha pachati pachate tari tayoho eka tulanatma kadhyayanam kartum shaknuvanti yatra drashtum shaknuvanti kim samanam asti kim cha parivartatam asti yada vayam parasmat, parasmai padyam kurma puna atmane padyam kurma so I've just given you in a format that will help you do a little bit of a comparative study of the Parasmai Padi and the Atmane Padi forms. And you see you've got Pachati and Pachate, Pachasi and Pachase. So E becomes A generally, Pachami and Pache, it's a little different. Uh, and then basically look at all the different forms to become a little more uh, familiar with the application in these two kinds of conjugations of the same verb. Astu, Tatra Pi Tarivayam Ekam Vakyam Kurmatra that uh, uh, they too cook food for their friend. They too cook food for their friend. Iti vadantu vakyam, they too. Tari te cook food. So cook will be pachataha. Okay. So let me take that for you. So te pachataha huh? for their friend. Tari, they, they too. So, tayoho mitra, mitra bhyam krite. Okay. Or tayoho uh, mitra bhyam also can work. So, te pachataha, te bhojanam pachataha, tayoho mitra yoho krite. Or tayoho mitra bhyam. Astu, uttamam. Now, I'd like you to do it in the um, uh, for the for themselves if they were now cooking for themselves what would happen so they too cook for themselves some food Tari. they because it's they too cook for themselves so it will become pachete bhojanam ok the moment you say bhojanam pachete we understand that it is happening for them uttamam agregachamaha so, this is the next one which is the lit parokshe, lit iti huh? and tatra kim bhavati papa cha pe chatuhu pe chuhu pe chitha pe chatuhu pe cha astu anantaram papa cha papa cha and then pe chiva and pe chima. So, when pashama yat prayatra pe iti rupam yojitam bhavati tatra. And prathamam atra prathama purushasya punaha uttama purushasya eka vachane samanam api rupam tatra vartate papacha papacha punaha papacha api eka vikalpena bhavitu marhati. Atmane padyam kim bhavati tari kripaya mayasa etesham rupanam abhyasam kurvantu. Teneva mukhe etesham kim vadama parichaya bhavishati. Uh, tena cha yada upayoga kalaha bhavati saralataram tad nirgamishati ataha avashyam tatra mayasaha vadantu and samakale tase artha bodham api manasi sthapya kurvantu tarhi peche bohu vichitra rupani santikani chanakarnam samanyataha vayam etesham upayogam na kurmaha so these are all very strange forms a little strange simply because of the fact that we don't really use them so often 
in our languages so so uh, please make sure that you're saying it along so that you have a little more familiarity and confidence with the application of this particular verb at least so peche pechate pechire pechishe pechate pechidwe peche samanam as the prathama uh, purusha like you can see also with the parasme padi pechi vahe and pechi mahe astu so how would you say uh, how would you say uh, so they let's say in the ramayana kala okay they cooked food for uh, they cooked food for themselves okay so what would happen it will become te bhojanam pechire okay this is one form that you find very often in the text uh, where if you have the as dhatu it will become babhuva so bhu or as dhatu tend to become babhuva iti rupani jagam babhuva that's part of this parokshe lit iti rupam so you have another format of doing the comparative study for the two kinds of conjugations atmanepadi and parasmepadi agre ka chama so we've got the lut the anadyatana bhavishyat and uh, tatra rupam bhavati pakta pakta rau pakta raha pakta si pakta stha pakta stha pakta smi pakta swaha and pakta smaha uttamam आत्मने पद्यां किं भवति पक्ता पश्यतु समानं रूपं तत्र वस्तुतः प्रथमपुरुषस्य परस्मै पद्यां पुनः आत्मने पद्यां समानमेव रूपम् अस्ति अस्तु पक्ता पक्तारो पक्तारः स्पष्ट अग्रे किं भवति पक्ता से तरे सीका सी तस्य से भवति यथा वर्तमानकाले अपि भवति पक्तास्थः अत्र पक्तास्थे भवति पक्तास्थ पक्ता द्वे भविष्यति पक्ता हे इति भवति पक्ता स्वहे एंड पक्ता स्महे वयम् पश्याम यद अत्र लट लकारेन किञ्चित् साम्यम् वर्तते हा तरि अत्र रूपाणि यदा पश्याम वयम् पश्याम यद अत्र किञ्चित् लट लकारेन से सह रूपाणि संगच्छन्ति अस्तु किन्तु अत्र एकं प्रयोगं कर्तुं प्रयत्नं कुर्म सो दिस इज द अनद्यतन भविष्यत् ओके सो यू विल कुक food uh, for your family what will that happen tari tvam parivara parivaraya bhojanam pakta si okay that's in the future tense uh, like far away in the future pakta si and then you have uh, uh, maybe you make that in the plural so you yam kim bhavishyati kim bhavishyati you yam parivarasya krite bhojanam पक्तास्थ इति भवति तत्र अस्तु एंड नाउ इफ यू आर कुकिंग फॉर योरसेल्फ्स यू आर कुकिंग फॉर योरसेल्फ्स इट वुड बी पक्ताद्वे इति भविष्यति अस्तु एवं परिवर्तनं कृत्वा सो यू कैन प्ले विथ यू नो चेंजिंग आइदर द नंबर्स और यू कैन चेंज यू कैन प्ले बाय चेंजिंग द पर्स द डिरेक्शन ऑफ द फ्रूट विद परस्मे पदी एंड आत्मने पदी तरी बहु प्रकार अत्र धातु भी सह क्रीडाम कर्तुं शक्यते कस्मिन् लकारे क्रीडाम भवति एका भवति पुनः कहा पुरुषः किं वचनम् सर्वत्र अत्र उपयोगाय बहु क्रीडा हा कल्पयि तुम शक्नुवन्ति सो यू कैन रियली कंसीव ऑफ वेरियस काइंड्स ऑफ गेम्स यूजिंग द पुरुषा यूजिंग द वचना यूजिंग द लकारा एट्सेट्रा एट्सेट्रा एंड एंड आल्सो यूजिंग द उभय पदी परस्माय पदी सो दिस इज समथिंग दैट यू विल बी एनकाउंटरिंग इन द असाइनमेंट एस वेल एस इन द टेस्ट सो वी विल बी ट्राइंग टू प्ले अराउंड विद दिस परमिटेशंस एंड कॉम्बिनेशंस पॉसिबल अस्तु सो ऑल्डो दिस इज एन अनाद्यतन भविष्य to talk of not only the adhyatana bhavishyat but also the anadhyatana bhavishyat is sometimes or often um, presented using the lrit lakaraha okay tari lrit evatra si adhyatana bhavishyat iti tari tatra kim bhavati pakshati pakshataha pakshanti pakshasi pakshataha pakshatha pakshami pakshyavaha पक्षियाँ महा, ओके, 
तत् इतोपि किञ्चिद् परिचितं वर्तते परिचितः रूपः परिचितं रूपं वर्तते तत्र किं भवति आत्मने पद्यां पक्षते पक्षीयते पक्ष्यन्ते पक्षसे पक्षीयते पक्षध्वे पक्षे पक्ष्यावहे पक्ष्यामहे तरि टुनाइट वी विल कुक सम फूड फॉर माय ब्रदर लेट्स से हाँ टुनाइट वी एस इन बहुवचने वी विल कुक फूड फॉर माय ब्रदर सो व्हाट विल दैट बी अद्य रात्रों वयम अस्माकम और मामा भ्रातु हु इट कैन बी अस्माकम भ्रातु हु और मामा भ्रातु डिपेंड्स ऑन वेदर इट्स माय ब्रदर और आवर ब्रदर हाँ वयम भोजनम पक्षियामा असु बिकॉज़ वे कुकिंग इट फॉर समबडी एल्स सपोज़ यू वे कुकिंग फूड फॉर योरसेल्स टुनाइट देन इट विल बी वयम अद्य रात्रों भोजनम पक्षिया महे इति भविष्यति आत्मनेपद्यम भविष्यति उत्तमम् अग्रेगच्छामा तेरी अत्र वयम् रूपानाम् परिचयम् प्राप्नुमा तत्र परस्मेपदि आत्मनेपद्या हा तुलनात्मकाध्यनार्थम् एवं प्रस्तावनम् कृतम् वर्तते अनत्र वयम् पश्यामा यथा लटलकारे भवति तथैव भविष्यकाले रूपानि भवन्ति अतः एकस्य रूपस्य परिज्ञाने न तत्र भविष्यकालस्य विशेष रूपम ज्ञातवा अंते यत तिंग अंतह अस्ति तत प्रायः समानम् एवं भवति अत्र ओके सो बिकॉज़ देर इज़ अ वेरी ग्रेट सिमिलरिटी बिटवीन द लट और द वर्तमान काल एंड द रिट और द भविष्यत काल बी इफ यू नो वन रियली वेल देन वी कैन अप्लाई इट फॉर द अदर जस्ट नोइंग द डिफरेंट ट्रांस Parasmai Padi and Atmane Padi. So once you learn that pattern, you will know the application of it. Asu, tari agrega chama. We are in the lot lakara idanim, the ajyartham. Tatra kim bhavatu? Kim bhavati? Pachatu, pachatat. Tari pachatu, pachatat, pachatat, praya ha vayam na pashyama. Kadachitat sahitya eva bhavati. Bahu viralam eva sakshat abhyasit asya parichay ha milati. Tari pachatu or pachatat, anantram pachatam, pachantu, pacha pachatat, samanam rupa masti tatra, pachatam, pachata, pachani, pachava, pachama. Tari asmakam narindra arya tatra praya etasya dhatu nam vishay yada vadati, sahekam el rupena artham ekam tippanim dadati tatra. He gives a small note, so he says it is tam tam ta. Okay, so he says pachatam, pachatam, pachata. So the tu from the vartamana kala, uh, ti becomes tu, anti becomes antu, and then you've got pacha, huh, which doesn't have any further ending there, and then pachami becomes pachani iti, puna tatra pachavaha of the lathlakara becomes pachava, and pachamaha becomes pachama. Tari, you can see the similarities again uh, if you know the lat very well, and you know the associative similarities with the other lakaras. तरी मुखास्ता करने किंचित न्यूनम न्यूना हा भारा हा भवति इति सो दिस इल लिटिल बिट ऑफ यू नो योर लोड ऑफ मेमोराइजेशन इज रिड्यूस्ड इफ यू कैन स्टार्ट आईडेंटिफाइंग दिस पैटर्न्स अस्तु अगरे गच्छामा तत्र आत्मनेपद्याम किं भवति पचताम बट यू सी इट्स लाइक द द्वितीय द्विवचनम ऑफ द प्रथम प Pachatam just gets the ekara pachetam and pachantam. So we see that in the first line you've got the tam, tam, tam that is the common thing and you've got the a in the middle and the nakara for the bahuvacharam. Anantaram pachaswa and then pachetam pachadhvam. Okay, so that is also a bit similar to your latlakara. Anantaram pachai in the vartamana kala or the latlakara it was pachay, so pachai. Pachavahe becomes Pachavahai and Pachamahe becomes Pachamahai. So, uh, there are similarities within the Parasmepadi and Atmanipadi and there are also similarities with other Lakaras that you can fall back upon. So, Tari Atra Eka Rupam Pashyama. So, cook food. So, you all cook food um, for this group. 
so you all cook food for this group how would you say that you all you yum cook food bhojanam pachata for this group so for this group you can either say etasya ganasya krite or you can say etasmai ganaya it can be another application there astu ha so you yum bhojanam etasya ganasya krite pachata or etasmai ganaya pachata iti tatra bhavati astu spashtam and if you say cook food for yourselves it will be bhojanam pachadvam you don't even need to say more than that ha huh? the moment you say that it implies you're cooking food for yourselves ha huh? and that's here astu tari agre gachhamah rupani tatra parasparam parichayartham atra sthapitavati tari samyak pashyantu do a lot of this visual grasping of the language ekam tu asya sambhashanam uchchahi pathitva pathitva भाषाया श्रवणे तस्य युक्ति बोधः पुनः द्वितीय अस्ति तस्य दर्शने अपि युक्ति बोधः भवितुम अर्हति सो व्हेन वन यू कैन अक्वायर द लॉजिक बाय लिसनिंग टू द साउंड्स ऑफ इट एंड गेटिंग अ फील ऑफ इट द टेस्ट ऑफ दैट वर्ब फॉर्मेट इन योर माउथ द अदर वन इज व्हेन यू आर विजुअली आल्सो ट्राइंग टू ग्रास्प द सिमिलैरिटीज एंड डिफरेंसेस इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू अस्तु agre gachama and what i would suggest you do is that you have a big sheet and you put the lakaras all side by side ha huh? and mark the endings and then you'll see where all across which uh, you know blocks of conjugations there will be the similarities that will appear that eva mem api kartum shaknuvanti agre pashyama lang lakarasya tattu asti anadya tana bhuta iti etad api kinchit परिचितम एव अस्ति सो दिस इज आल्सो क्वाइट अ फैमिलियर यूजेज अपचत अपचताम अपचन अपच अपचतम अपचत अपचम अपचाव एंड अपचाम आई लाइक टू जस्ट ड्रॉ योर अटेंशन टू द फैक्ट दैट दिस इज क्लोज टू द लोट लकार एंड व्हाई इज इट क्लोज देयर इफ यू जस्ट गो बैक यू सी पचतु पचताम सो ताम तम त पचानी पचाव पचाम ओके पचतु एंड पचंतु Uh, here, pachatu, pachantu, and tam tam ta, pachani, pachava, and pachama. Now let's look what happens here. So here you've got pachat, apachat. Ha, huh? so the ta it becomes an apachan. Okay, tu and an tu sort of drop the uh, tu's drop off, and you've got apachatam. And you see apachatam, apachatam, apachat ta. Ha, huh? tam tam ta, which is the same. And there you had pacha, it becomes apacha. Visarga ha tatra yojitam bhavati. अपचम आगछति अनन्तरम अपचाव एंड अपचाम इति भवति तरी मिलित्वा एकवारं पुनरपि वदाम अपचत अपचताम अपचन अपचह अपचतम अपचत अपचम अपचाव अपचाम उत्तमम तरी आत्मने पद्याम किं भवति इति अपचत अपचेताम अपचन्त अपचथाह अपचेथाम अपचध्वम अपचे अपचाव ही एंड अपचाम ही तत्र एक पश्याम कथम भवति हाँ सो पचै पचाव हई पचाम हई अस्तु हाँ तरी पुनः तत्र था एंड ध्वम आर द सेम बट पचस्व इज अ लिटल डिफरेंट विद अ लोट पश्यंत अत्र पचथा पचे था एंड पचध्वम तो अत्र बहु साम्यम वर्तते अस्तु एंड अत्र ऐ आसी अत्र वहि एंड पचामहि इति भवति तरी एकम धातु वदाम तरी हाउ वुड यू से अप आई कुक्ड फूड आई कुक्ड फूड फॉर एवरी वन येस्टडे हाँ सो दिस इज अनद्यतन भूत सो नॉट टुडेज भूत सो अहम सर्वेशाम कृते भोजनम अपचम उत्तम एंड आई कुक्ड फूड फॉर माई सेल्फ येस्टडे अहम योजनम अपचे अस्तु स्पष्ट अस्ति तरी अग्रे गा दिस इज फॉर यू टू डू अ 
comparative study again with the Atmanipadi and Parasmaipadi or the Parasmaipadi first and then the Atmanipadi. Saptamagan el lakare kim bhavati vidhi ling iti tatra pachet pachetam. So again, you find similarities here. So you see the tam tam ta again appearing in the L in the middle like that and pacheva and pachema. And you see the um of the bhuta kalab here becomes pacheyamma. So there's a ya that enters into that. But otherwise, it's pachet and then pacheyuhu. There it was apachanna. Atra pacheyuhu bhavati. Some similarities and some differences, but patterns santi tatra tatra apachaha atra apachehe so the chehe is a feature of the vidhiling ha huh? you see it's there in the parasmaipadi and in the atmanepadi tari apach not a but pachet the a literally is a uh, is a prefix that indicates that which is not there now huh? so yatha satyam a satyam that which is not true so pachat apachat that a makes it it is not true now so here it is pachet. So you must do that, huh? Vidhiling. So pachet, pachetam, pache yuhu, pachehe, pachetam, pacheta, pache yam, pacheva, and pache ma. Uttamam. Atma nepadyam kim bhavati? Pacheta, pache yatam. Tari atra ya iti yojitam bhavati. Pache yatam, pache ran, pache thaha, pache yatam, pache dhwam. Pache ya, pache vahi and pache mahi. Punarapi ekasyam ekasmin patre yadi rupani likhanti sarvani uh, or sarvan lakaran likhanti chet tatra spashtam bhavishati paraspara sammandham api. Okay, so if you write it all out on one big sheet of paper with color codes, you'll be able to identify the similarities and differences that are there between the different tenses and moods. Astu, tarhi. Um, uh, how would you say uh, that they should cook food for the yajna? Let's say. Huh? So, they should cook food for the yajna. Tari? They should cook. Te pache yuhu. What should they pache yuhu? Bhojanam. Or let's say prasad. Tari? Te prasadam pache yuhu. For what? Yajnaya. For the sacrifice or for the yajnya. Tari te yajnyaya uh, prasadam pache yuhu iti bhavati. And they cook for themselves kim bhavishati? Te bhojanam or prasadam pache ran. Uh, so they cooked the prasad for themselves iti bhavati. So here you've got the comparative form of the vidhiling. Asu. Tari pashyata kim samanam kimcha tatra bhinnam asti. Astu, huh? Agregachama. Um, atra ashir lingasi, atra pashama punaha kim samanam kimcha binamasi. Tari pachyat, huh? Tari tatra pachet asid atra chia iti uh, praveshaha bhavati. Tari pachyat pashatu. Uh, Parasme padyam to sarvatra samanaha tatra uh, agama rupena vartate. Okay, that's the new uh, addition that is there everywhere. Pachyat pachyas tam 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 ta asti. Okay, that you can see here. But here you have got this extra pachyas tam pachyasuhu. Huh? And tatra asit. Let's look at the vidhiling atra. Sorry, atreva asti pachyuhu. And here you have pachyasuhu. Okay, then pachyaha. What was it here? It was pachehe. Hmm? So the che, che, che is replaced by the chaha. In the Ashirling. Pachyaha, Pachyastam, Pachyasta, Pachyasam, Pachyaswa, Pachyasma. Astu, so, what I'd really like you would like to invite you to do is once you've seen it, Tari Netre Nimilia, uh, see if you can again recollect the forms. So, even if you can do it once when it is there, at least that will give you some confidence that you're able to grasp the the different formats of it at least for that moment huh? but tasya pi abhyasam ekavaram kurvanti so don't just do passively uh, you can do the pause button see if you can repeat it you learn it write it out likhanti ched avashyam tasya smaranam varataram bhavati okay agrega chama tatra uh, atmane padyam kim bhavati pakshishta pakshiyastam 
पक्षीरन्न पक्षीष्ठाह पक्षीयास्थाम पक्षीध्वम पक्षीय पक्षी वही एंड पक्षी मही अस्तु सो दिस इज अ ब्लेसिंग रियली व्हेन इट सेज दैट त्वम पक्षीष्ठाह त्वम भोजनम पक्षीष्ठाह सो कुक फूड फॉर योर सेल्फ एज अ ब्लेसिंग वुड बी समथिंग एज ग्रैंड एज पक्षीष्ठाह सो देर इज दिस ग्रैंडर अबाउट दिस आशीर्लिंग अ लिटिल बिट हा सो यू शुड उक्तवा ट्राई एंड गिव दिस feeling of the um, sounds of the language but i just like to t- do a small comparison with the uh, at- atmane pada of the uh, vidhiling so you see it is pachethaha becomes pakshishtaha uh, thaha it becomes thaha and the sakara becomes the uh, shakara there because uh, the tha becomes the tha there astu see pakshiyastham and atra asti पचे या थाम सो यास हैज गॉट एडेड देर पचे ध्वम पक्षी ध्वम पक्षीय पक्षी वही एंड पक्षी मही पचे य पचे वही एंड पचे मही असो सो यू सी द सिमिलैरिटीज ऑफ द क्लोजनेस दैट इज देर तरी अत्र तो एक वाक्यम अभवत पच्यास्तम सो युवाम भोजनम सो यू कुक फूड एज अ एज अ ब्लेसिंग कुक फूड uh for for the puja uh, supposing so you you too cook food for the puja what will it be so you too cook food will be yuvam bhojanam pachyastam for the puja chaturthi vibhakti bhavati tari puja yai tari yuvam पूजा यै भोजनम पच्यास्तम बट यू डोंट इवन नीड टू से युवाम इफ यू से पच्यास्तम अतः यू कैन रिड्यूस इट वेरी सिंपली टू कुक फूड फॉर द पूजा विल बिकम पूजा यै भोजनम पच्यास्तम इति अस्तु एंड कुक फूड फॉर योर सेल्फ विल बिकम भोजनम पक्षीयास्थाम भिन्न किंतु कथनेन तस्य परिचय वर्धिष्यते अनदर कंपेरेटिव टेबल फॉर यू हियर नवम गण लुंग तत्र किम भवति नवम लकार अद्यतन भूत अस्ति तत्र अपाक्षीत अपाक्ताम अपाक्षु अपाक्षी अपाक्त अपाक्त अपाक्षम अपाक्षु अपाक्षम सो आर ऑल्सो लाइक टू मेन्शन दैट प्रयोग लुंग प्रयोग विरल साषण प्राय तस् साहित्य रूपदर्शन अत्र यथा वह भविष्य काल से भविष्य काले यथा वह अद्यतन भविष्य काले अनद्यतन भविष्य अभी उपयोग कूम तथा वह अनद्यतन भूत से अद्यतन भूत भूते अभी उपयोग कूम सो वी टेन टू से अहम अपचम फॉर एक्सापल अहम अद प्रातः भोजनम अपचम इज वॉट वी वुड टेन टू से नॉर्मली बट हियर वी सी दैट इफ इट इज एक्चुअल विद इन द फ्रेम वर्क ऑफ टूडे इट शुड बी अहम अद्य भोजनम अपाक्षम ओके अद्य अपाक्षीत अपाक्षता अपाक्षु अपाक्षी अपाक्त अपाक्त अपाक्षम अपाक्षु एंड अपाक्षम अस्तु एंड अत्र वह आत्मने पद्याण यदा पशा तरी किम अपक्त अपक्षाता अपक्षत अपक्था अपक्षता अपग्ध्व अपक्षी अपक्षव ही एंड अपक्षम ही प्लीज से दीज वर्ड्स बिकॉज लाइक आई सैड इन द प्रीवियस केस ऑल्सो यूल डिस्कवर वेरी डिफरेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ योर वोकल सिस्टम बाय ट्राइंग टू जस्ट प्रनाउंस दीज सेंटेंस दीज वर्ड फॉर्मेश दीज वर्ब कॉन्जुगेशन अस्तु हाँ तरी अपाक्षीत ये सह भोजनम अपाक्षीत इति भवति ओके तरी अग्रे गच्छा मात्र 
we do see the application of this in certain contexts like if in the uh, context of the bhu dhatu so you would say for example that adya prata vrishtir abhut huh? so this abhut has a sense of it happened a few hours back that kind of a sense uh, and apakshit so the food was cooked this morning let's say huh? in that context astu very agregatsama antima lakara asti ring lakara tatra kim bhavati yatha atra likhitam asti apakshyat so i told you it is a combination of the bhuta and the vartaman uh, bhavishya kala so you got a pakshat so would have cooked tari yadi samaya abhavishyat saha bhojanam sarvesham krite apakshat so if there was time then he would have cooked food for everybody tari yadi samaya abhavishyat if there had been time or if there would have been time then tada saha bhojanam apakshat sarvesham krite then he would have cooked food apakshat uh, for everybody sarvesham krite iti bhavati asu tari tasya rupani uh, pashyama apakshatam apakshyan apakshyah apakshatam apakshata apakshyam apakshyava and apakshyam so if you know the lang lakara well and you know the lrit lakara well then you know very easily how to do the kriyati patil ring there is zero extra investment in learning how to do the kriyati patil ring karanam eta dvayo eva tatra melanam asti atra we've not written kriyati patil ring but that's how it is said in some parts of the country astu uh, and then in the atmanepadi kim bhavati apakshyata apakshyetam apakshyanta apakshyathaha apakshyetham apakshyadvam apakshye apakshyavahi and apakshyamahi astu spashtam asti tari agre pashyama atra rupani bhavanti so how would you say if we had the time we would have cooked food for ourselves what how would you say that yadi samaya abhavishyat vayam bhojanam apakshya mahi iti astu spashtam how would you do that in the uh, for the uh, dvivachanam yadi samaya abhavishyat that remains the same avam bhojanam apakshya vahi you don't even need to say the avam because vahi indicates it all ha ah, tatra eva sanskrita bhashaya brevity bhavati and precision api bhavati ha ah? astu spashtam asti hmm? tari agre gachama astu so thus far we've looked at the dasha lakaras for the uh, pach dhatu which is from the bhuadi ganaha and we've looked at it in its ubhaya padi format so with the parasmay padi and the atmane padi kept side by side so that you can do a comparative study of the changes that the verb undergoes in both these forms astu tari idani what i'd love to do for you is to introduce you to the passive voice or the karma vachyam तरी कर्मवाच्य से परिचय इदानी अहम कर्म इच्छा त्र कचन नियम सी ये तत्म सहजमी भवती सो लेट्स लुक एट सम ऑफ द रूल्स दट आर असोसिएटेड विद दीज डिफरेंट वॉइसेस कर्तृवाच्यम किं वदति लक्षण कर्तृवाच्य प्रथमा कर्तृकारके द्वितीयांतम भवेत् कर्म कर्तृधीन क्रियापदम सो वॉट इज इट सेंग लक्षण कर्तृवाच्य से प्रथमा कर्तृकारके सो इट इज द फर्स्ट इन द कर्तृकारक इट इज द सब्जेक्ट विल गेट द कर्तृकारक द्वितीयांत भवेत् कर्म हाँ सो द्वितीया विभक्ति विल कम ऑन द कर्म एंड कर्तृधीन क्रियापदम एंड द वर्ब विल मैच विथ द सब्जेक्ट देर और द कर्ता कर्मवाच्य किं भवती पश्याम कर्मवाच्य प्रयोग तो तृतीया कर्तृकारके प्रथमा भवेत् कर्म कर्माधीन क्रियापदम सो वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग इट चेंजेस पोजिशन हियर इट्स कर्मवाच्य प्रयोग तो तृतीया कर्तृकारके सो द कर्तृकारक और द नॉमिनेटिव केस अत्र विल बिकम द तृतीया विभक्ति एंड प्रथमा भवेत् कर्म न द कर्म विल बिकम द प्रथमा विभक्ति कर्माधीन क्रियापदम एंड हाउ डू यू डिसाइड वॉट कैंड ऑफ वर्ब एंडिंग यू विल गेट इट विल गो अकॉर्डिंग टू द कर्म विच इज नाउ बिकम द सब्जेक्ट बिकॉज इट हेज द प्रथमा विभक्ति ऑन इट अस्तु भाववाच्य किं भवती सो भाववाच्य इज ऑफन वेन देर इज नो ऑब्जेक्ट इट्स एन इन ट्रांसिटिव वर्ब अस्तु तत्र किं भवती 
भावे कर्तुस्तृतीया स्यात् कर्मा भावश्च सर्वदा प्रथम पुरुषस्येक वचनम स्यात् क्रियापदे अस्तु सो व्हाट आर दे सेइंग दैट भावे कर्तुस्तृतीया स्यात् सो इन द भाववाच्यम द कर्तु गेस तृतीया लाइक इन द कर्मवाच्यम अस्तु कर्मा भावश्च सर्वदा सर्वदा देयर इज नो कर्म देयर बिकॉज़ इट इज एन इनट्रांसिटिव वर्ब देयर इज नो ऑब्जेक्ट देयर सो प्रथम पुरुषस्येक वचनम स्यात् क्रियापदे एंड देयरफॉर द क्रियापदम विल ऑलवेज बी इन द प्रथम पुरुषस्य एकवचनम इति अत्र उच्यते कर्मा भाव वाच्ययोः रूपसिद्धि नियमः ह सो व्हाट इज द रूपसिद्धि ऑफ द रूल फॉर द कर्म एंड भाव वाच्य द टू ऑफ देम सो इट सेज हियर कर्म वाच्य प्रयोगे तृतीया कर्तृकारके प्रथमान्तम भवेत कर्म कर्माधीनम क्रियापदम एंड दैट्स व्हाट वी लुक्ड एट प्रीवियसली एंड इट सेज भावे कर्मणि वाच्ये च सदा स्याद आत्मने पदम लडादिषु चतुर्ष्वेव यकार स्यागमो भवेत सो व्हाट आर दे सेइंग हियर दे आर सेइंग दैट भावे कर्मणि वाच्ये च सो इन बोथ दीस कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ द भाववाच्यम एंड द कर्मणि वाच्यम व्हाट हैपेंस सदा स्याद आत्मने पदम सो द वर्ब विल ऑलवेज बी इन द आत्मने पदम प्रथमतः देन लडादिषु स लट आदिषु चतुर्ष्वेषु व्हिच इज द लट लोट लंग एंड विद लिंग यकार स्यागमो भवेत सो यू हैव टू ऐड इन द यकार सो लेट्स ट्राई एंड डू एन एग्जांपल तत्र अस्तु तरी अत्र अस्ति छात्रः ग्रन्थः पठति तरी नियमः क अस्ति दट प्रथमा तृतीया भवति द्वितीया प्रथमा भवति अस्तु तरी अत्र वी हैव गॉट द प्रथमा विभक्ति एंड हियर वी हैव गॉट द द्वितीया विभक्ति सो व्हाट इज इट सेइंग दैट द प्रथमा विभक्ति विल बिकम द तृतीया एंड एट द सेम टाइम वी हैव गॉट द द्वितीया विभक्ति व्हिच इज द कर्म नाउ बिकम्स द प्रथमा विभक्ति अस्तु so what do we get here finally we have uh, the verb pathyate how did that happen so you see it says uh, it says that atmane padam bhavati sada atmane padam so it's atmane padam and ladadishu chaturshveshu yakara agama so you see there is a pathya y comes in because of this rule here this uh, indication here and you put it in the vartamana kala so if your first verb is in the vartamana kala it will take the same tense in the uh, atmane padi also parasme padyam atmane padyam samanam eva rupam bhavati and uh, atah vayam idanim yani rupani lakarani uh, vayam dasha lakaraha drishtavantah tasya atra upayogah bhavitum arhati astu tari chhatrah grantham pathati tell me chhatrena granthah pathyate uttamam next छात्रा ग्रंथान पढ़ती, so one student reading many books, what happens if you do it in the कर्म वाच्यम्? so छात्रा becomes छात्रेना तृतीया, so one becomes three and two, okay so this is two plural, becomes two uh, nominative और तो प्रथम विभक्ति, अस्तु and then what does it say here also? that the verb will go along with the karta here ah huh? so what happens you get pathati becomes pathyante because granthaha granthaha pathyante which is bahu the bahu vachanam spashtam asti astu agre pashyama itopi kinchit permutation and combination chhatraha grantham or granthan pathanti so if it is grantham सो छात्रा हा नाउ द सब्जेक्ट इज प्लूरल तरी छात्र ही ग्रंथम ओके सो दिस इज योर सिंगुलर एंड द सेकंड विभक्ति एंड यू हैव गॉट हियर द ग्रंथः ओके सो दिस बिकम्स द प्रथमा एंड द सिंगुलर एंड ग्रंथान इफ इट्स प्लूरल सो इफ इट इज प्लूरल एंड द द्वितीय इट विल बिकम द प्लूरल एंड द प्रथमा and pathanti because it goes with the noun it will either be pathyate if it goes for the singular and it will be pathyante if it goes with the uh, the plural format of it astu spashtam asti abhyasam kurma kinchit so let's do some practice here chhatra pustakani pathati kim bhavati chhatrena okay 
Pratama Dritya Bhavati, Pustakani, we cannot really see the difference. So, it will stay the same. Although, in this case, it is the Prathama Vibhakti now. Pustakani and Pathyante. Uttamam. Okay, so it becomes Pathyante. Next one, Tvam Maam Vadasi. What happens then? Uttamam, Tritya will be Tvaya. Maam will become Aham, Uttamam. Tvaya, Aham, Udye. Now tell me there has to be a small correction here. Uttamam. This will become a Mahalant there. So, Tvaya Aham Udye. Huh? Next, Aham Ramayanam Pathami. Kim Bhavati, Aham Kim Bhavishati? Maya. So, Tvam becomes Tvaya, Aham becomes Maya. Maya Ramayanam because it is a Kavyam. And then because it is singular, it will become Pathyate. Asu, Spashtamasi, Maya Ramayanam Pathyate. Uttamam. Next, Vayam Nagaram Gachamaha. Kim Bhavishati Tritya Karotu? Uttamam. Asma Bhihi Nagaram Ataha Samanam Tishthati Yataha Tad Napunsakalinga Padamasi. So, Dvitiya Vibhakti, Prathama Vibhakti Samanam Tishthati. And then it will be Gachamaha Gamyate. Asu. So, Asma Bhihi Nagaram Gamyate. So, it literally means that the town is gone by us. Uh, this is the passive format here. And then you have got Thvam Chandram Pashya. So, that is the Lot Lakara. So, you have to uh, change to the Atma Nepada in the Lot form itself. Tarikim Bhavishyati. Prathama Matra. How would you do it? It is Thvaya Chandraha. So, Prathama becomes Tritya. Dvitya becomes Prathama. That is like a formula. And then Pashya is the Lotlakara, Atha Atra Bhavishati, Drishyatam. Or if you say Pashya C, it will become Drishya Tvaya Chandraha Drishyate. Astu, Spashtam Asti. So, the, the moon is seen by you. Iti artha bhavati atra. So, let us see what happens to the last sentence which is Balakaha chandram apashyat becomes Prathama becomes Tritya. So, Balakena chandram dvitya becomes Prathama. So, chandraha and apashyat will become a drishyata. Huh? Because it has to be in the same kala. So, the lang lakara here. And that is what you have here. As to, just one small note I want to add about the passive voice. The passive voice somehow is the more natural voice in the Sanskrit language. Atra adhikam swabhavikam asti karma vache sambhashitum natu kartra vache sambhashitum. Atari vayam yada vadama maya gamyate natu aham gachami tat adhunika kale adhikam jatam vartate. Kintu yadi vayam praudhan shunmaha yadi vayam asmakam jeshthan shunmaha vayam shunmaya tatra prayaha karma vachyasya eva prayayugaha adhikaha bhavati. Astu tari etatu aramha matram agrima vargeshu vayam etasya itopi vivaranam karishyamaha etasya bodham api adhikam dasyamaha abhyasasya to avasarha bhavatyeva tari tatra avasyam Bhavantaha samyak swasya api prayasam kurvantu iti prarthana asti. So, just a quick note here that the karma vacham is somehow or the passive voice is the more natural voice in the Sanskrit language. We do not really use so easily the active voice of I go there. You would tend to or pref there was a preference, let me say, for saying that I the place is gone by me, which is very absurd if you say it in English. But in the Sanskrit language, we have heard our elders and all use more of the passive voice in the in a natural uh, sambhashanam uh, uh, tatra bhavati and there are other kinds of philosophical reasons also that one is more an instrument of life's experiences than the doer of life's activities ataha passive voice tatra swabhavik swabhavena sangachati iti so let's do a conversation with piyush Namaste Ari, Bhavati Kushalini Kim. 
आम पीयूष नमस्ते कुशलिनी अहम कुशलम कामये वदतु अद्यतन लकार से पाठा तव कोपी प्रश्न अस्त किम आम आर्य दश गर्वदा स्मर्त क्लेशो भवती कोपी सहजोपाय अस्त चेत कृपया वदतु साधु प्रश्न प्रयतिष्ये तत् सहजतर कर्त अस्तु अस्तु आर्य वदतु यतेन अस्माक अन्त्रापी लाभो भविष्य सुष्ठु तरी शृणु प्रायश लठलकार से उत वर्तमान काल से नृठलकार से उत भविष्य काल से तिंगत भाग सवती तथा भविष्य 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 पुनः लोट उत आज्ञाया लंगलकारेण साम्यम अस्त बहुषु स्थानु विशेषतः द्विवचने यथा गच्छता त्र अगछता लंगी एवं विधिलिंग लंगलकारेण रूपा संगछति यथा गेत अगछत इत्यादय अंत तो लृंगा स्मर्त कोपी क्लेश न सूपम लंग लृटयो और लृट्यो लंग लृट्यो उत अनद्यतन भूत भविष्य सम्मेलन जातम अस्त यथा अगमिष्यत अखादिष्यत अथवा अपक्षत इति उत्तम आर्ये अहम भवत्या वचना स्मर्त प्रयतिष्ये अतिम एक प्रश्न अस्त आत्मने पद्या परस्म पद्या रूपा कथम मुखस्थम कर्त शक्म कृपया वदत मम अध्यापक नरेन्द्र आर्य से पुस्तक बहूनी व्याकरणा गीता सी व्याकरणगीता सी तेजु एक तेन विरचित स्पीक् संस्कृत ईजी वे पुस्तक ते सर्वे अभी लभंते समय भवति चेत अवश्य पठ अस्त आर्य अनुगृहस्मी शुभमस्तु शुभमस्तु अस्तु तरी अहम चिंतवती नरेन्द्र आर्य से एक गीत अत्र प्रस्तौमी तरी एक धातुसारण्या गीत किमस्त तत्र नाम अद्य श्व आर्य ह्य विधिपूर्वक अत्र पश्यंत सह वदति एतानि अथवा अत्र लकार से लक्षण सी यहाँ अद्य वर्तमान काल श्व भविष्य काल आर्य लोट यद्यतन भूत विधिलिंग अत्र विधिपूर्वक ते अत्री रूपा संगछती यहाँ आमी एंड गमिष्या श्व पुनः अद्य गता आनी आर्य अहम गच्छा अहम अगछम ह्यते एंड गेय विधिपूर्वक अत्र परस्मे पदी अत्र आत्मने पदी भिन्न भिन्न पुषाण अत्र दत्तमस्ति तरी प्रयत्न कुर्म अस्तु अद्य श्व आर्य ह्य विधिपूर्वक आमी आनी अम यम ए ऐ ए आमी आनी अम यम ए ऐ ए आव 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 एव हे हई हि हि आव 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 एव हे हई हि हि यूयम थे ध्व यूयम थे ध्व सेस्वथा आमी आनी अम यम ए ऐ ए आव 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 एव हे हई हि हि इंति इंतु इंयुक्ते इंते इंता इंतरन तीत्सा तेता तूयम थे ध्व यूयम थे ध्व अनतर तस्ता तौ थस्तम युवम एते एथे एथाम ए याथाम थस्तम युवम एथे एथाम ए याथाम यूयम थे ध्वे ध्वम यूयम थे ध्वे ध्वम ध्वम से स्वथा आमी आनी अम यम ए ऐ ए आव 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 एव हे हई हि हि आव 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 एव हे हई हि हि तस् गीत किंच आनंदपूर्वक व्याकरण से पाठ अभी भवि अर्हति एक मगेण 
अस्तु मूविंग ऑन टू द इम्पार्टेन्ट पार्ट इदानीं धर्म पदस्य गुणाः के सन्ति इति वयं दृष्टवन्तः एकवारं मिलित्वा पठामः एतत् क्षमा द सत्यं दम शौचं दानमिंद्रिय संयमः अहिंसा गुरुशुश्रूषा तीर्थानुसरणं दया आर्जवं लोभशून्यम देवब्राह्मण पूजनम अनभ्यसूया च तथा धर्म सामान्य उच्यते इति एतावता वयं गुरुशुश्रूषां पर्यन्तं गतवर्गे दृष्टवन्तः तीर्थानुसरणम् इति अत्र वयं द्रक्ष्यामः तर्हि तीर्थानुसारण तीर्थानुसरणं किम् इत्युक्ते तीर्थ प्लस अनुसरणं तीर्थानुसरणम् इत्येतस्य व्युत्पत्तिः कथं भवति नाम तीर्थानाम् अनुसरणम् इति तीर्थानुसरणम् षष्ठी तत्पुरुषः सम तत्पुरुषः समासः तीर्थः इत्युक्ते किम् तीर्थः नाम तरति पाप पापादिकम् यस्मात् अस्तु तर्हि अनुसरणम् नाम किम् अनुसरणम् नाम अनुगमनम् हा तो to go after to follow अतः तीर्थानुसरणम् नाम to follow those ways or things which save us or help us escape or that help us escape from sins इति भवति in other words तीर्थः is some actions which help us to overcome or surpass the sins. So, Tirtha is some action which help us to overcome or surpass the uh, surpass sins or overcome. You can even say overcome. Overcome sins. Agregachama. तत्र तीर्थम त्रिविधम उच्चते स्थावरम भूमाव भिन्न भिन्न स्थान दर्शनम पुनः जंगमम की मसी वाक्य वारिना इच्छुते यत्र यत्र गुरवाह सत्संगम चार कुर्वन्ति तत्र गत्वा तेशाम वचनानाम श्रवणेना अस्माकम पुण्यम भवति वारी द्वारा पुण्य वारी अथवा पुण्य गंगा नदी इव तत्र तेशाम वचनानि अस्मान प्रक्षालयन्ति अतः तद पुण्य गमनम अस्ति तीर्थ गमनम इति मन्यन्ते मानसम मानसम सद्गुणैः भवति बाय वर्चुअस क्वालिटी एन एतदेव अति मुख्यम तत्र कीर्तितम वर्तते तर्हि मानस तीर्थ लक्षणम किम किम अस्ति सत्यम तीर्थम क्षमा तीर्थम तीर्थम मिंद्रिय निग्रहः सर्वभूतदया तीर्थम सर्वत्राजवमेव च दानम तीर्थम दमस तीर्थम संतोषस तीर्थम उच्चते ब्रह्मचर्यम परम तीर्थम तीर्थन चप्रियवादिता ज्ञानम तीर्थम दृतिस तीर्थम पुण्यम तीर्थम उदाहृतम तीर्था नाम पितत तीर्थम विशुद्धिर्मन सफपराह एतत्ते कथितम देवी मानसम तीर्थ लक्षणम एतत् काशी खंडह स्कंद पुराणे अस्ति एंड शब्द कल्पद्रुमे एतत् वर्तते एतत् सर्वम् अपि पीयूषस्य शोध कार्य द्वारा अत्र उपस्थापितः अस्ति अतः इतोपि गुण विषय ज्ञातुं बिच्छन्ति चेत् सह तत्र उत्तमः मार्गदर्शकः भवितुम् अर्हति एतस्य अर्थः कः व्हाट्स द मीनिंग ऑफ़ ऑल दिस ट्रूथ फॉरगिवनेस कंट्रोल ऑफ़ Charity, control, contentment are deliverers, but the supreme deliverance comes from abstinence, brahmacharyam, and following the path of the absolute, iti. Astu, uh, next is knowledge, self-command or courage, virtue are all said to be pilgrimages. Of all the pilgrimages or deliverers, is, is that para or the reality beyond the mind? This, O oh Goddess, these are the characteristics of psychological uh, pilgrimages. So here actually he says, this O Goddess I say unto you, etat te kathitam devi. So this Goddess I say to you, these are the characteristics of psychological or the mental uh, pilgrimages. 
अनाद पार्ट हु बेनिफिट्स फ्रॉम द तीर्थानु सरनम तरि यस्य हस्तौ च पादौ च मनश्चैव सुसंयतम विद्या तपश्च कीर्तिश्च तीर्थ फलम सत्तीर्थ फलम श्नुते अगेन क्लोज एंड हु बेनिफिट्स फ्रॉम तीर्थानु सरनम यस्य हस्तौ च पादौ च मनश्चैव सुसंयतम विद्या तपश्च कीर्तिश्च सतीर्थ फलम अश्नुते प्रतिग्रहादुपाहृत उपावृत्तः संतुष्टो येन केनचित अहंकार विमुक्तश्च सतीर्थ फलम फलम अश्नुते अदाम्भिको निरारंभो लघ्वाहारो जितेन्द्रिय विमुक्त सर्वसंग सतीर्थ फलम अश्नुते अकोपनोमलमति सत्यवादी दृढ़व्रत आत्मोपमश्च भूतेषु सतीर्थ फलम अश्नुते सो हु ऑल एंजॉय द फ्रूट्स ऑफ तीर्थ ही सेज द वन हुज हैंड्स एंड फीट एंड माइंड आर वेल कंट्रोल्ड एंड इज एंडाउड विद नॉलेज austerity and fame such a person tastes the fruit of tirtha one who returns satisfied with whatever he or she has received and is free from ego such a person tastes the fruit of tirtha one free of arrogance who abstains from all work eats little has controlled senses liberated and of all company liberated in and of all company eats the fruit of tirtha is not short tempered is pure minded truth speaking fulfills his or her vows regards the world as themselves this is very beautiful atmo pamascha it really treats the world as if they are themselves such a person eats the fruit of a tirtham and i just like to share with you here that particular very famous uh, verse that is almost like the hallmark of the indian culture which is ayam nijah paro veti ganana laghu chetasam उदार चरिता तो वसुधव कुटुंबक सो इट इज अयम निज परो वेति सो दिस इज माइन दिस इज दि अदर पर्सन गणना कैलक्युलेशन लघु चेतसा द पीपल हू हव अ पेटी माइंड एंटर इन टू दीज कैंड ऑफ कैलक्युलेशन उदार चरिता तो दोज हू हव अ जेनरस स्पिरीट वसुधव कुटुंबक द होल यूनिवर्स इज देर फैमिली अस्त एंड सम बेनिफिट्स ऑफ तीर्थानुसरण अकॉर्डिंग टू uh paramahansa yogananda when he talks of pilgrimages he says if you go to places where masters have lived the vibrations there will quicken your realization that is the value of pilgrimages to holy places the masters divine vibrations are still there just as strong as they, as when they were physically present those who are in tune will feel that presence but first one has to meditate and prepare himself kinchit references तरी अहम आशा कौमि यत अत्र दशलकाराणा किंचित परिचय जाता तरी धातूना विषय इदानी किंचित आत्मविश्वास वर्धिता अस्ति इति अहम विचारया तत्र अभी धातूना अभ्यास कर्म तो बहु अस्ति तत्र भवंत दृष्टवंत यहाँ तत्र धातव सी अतः पठन से तो पर्याप्तता नास्ति किंतु संभाषण यदि कुरती द्रक्ष्य शीघ्र तर त्र भाषाया ग्रहण भविष्य अतः कृपया संस्कृत वदंत संस्कृत वदंत संस्कृत वदंत अत्र विनम्र भावेन शुभमस्तु इति कामयन्ति विरमामि